Since 1985, the Institute for Transportation and Development Policy has been promoting environmentally sustainable and socially equitable transportation worldwide. With projects in Argentina, Brazil, China, Colombia, India, Indonesia, Mexico, South Africa, Tanzania, and the U.S., ITDP is at the forefront of efforts to reduce carbon emissions, protect the environment, enhance social equity, and improve the quality of urban life around the world. ITDP develops affordable, low emissions mass transit that is quickly becoming the future of transportation among the world's cities. Their signature initiative is Bus Rapid Transit. Bus Rapid Transit is a very high quality mass transit system that provides the same high speed of service the same high capacities that you would get with a metro system, but at a fraction of the cost, maybe a 20th of the, of the price. The bus also has a physically separated lane in the traffic so that it doesn't have to get stuck in traffic congestion. Bus Rapid Transit is an innovative public transportation system that can be implemented in a third of the time compared to a metro system. It's designed to benefit every member of society. Level boarding and multiple bays allow for easy access. A smooth and fast transit create a more enjoyable travel experience. Safe, weather protected, and modern stations are comfortable and secure. In many cities, BRT cuts commuting time by up to 50% while providing economic opportunity with more travel options. ITDP is one of the world's preeminent experts in BRT and has helped over a dozen cities with their systems. And the environmental benefits are incredible. In the case of the cities we work in, we usually expect to see a 20 to 30 percent reduction in air pollution in that corridor. You get that uh, greenhouse gas emission reduction from several sources. One is people switching from a polluting mode to a non-polluting mode. The other is if the buses are going faster, then fewer buses can move the same number of people, so they burn less fuel. And if you optimize the services, there tend to be more people on each bus. And that translates directly into a reduction in greenhouse gas emissions. ITDP's work in planning and advocacy for cycling and walking helps improve public space, encourages people to walk or bicycle, and improves access for those with few other mobility options. Bike share programs, bicycle lanes, bicycle parking, and providing direct technical assistance with pedestrian and walking infrastructure are some of ITDP's people-centered projects. ITDP is also playing an increasingly critical role in providing transport for rural healthcare workers and communities. <laughs> and promoting sustainable urban design. As well as reducing traffic through measures like congestion charging and parking reform. Today, the Institute for Transportation and Development Policy is working with city governments and local advocacy groups to address the critical problems that are facing our planet. Together, they are enhancing millions of people's lives and protecting our fragile environment. But there is always more work to be done as they strive to bring sustainable transport solutions to more cities around the world. 
To learn more about how you can be part of ITDP, go to itdp.org. ITDP is grateful to the following partners for supporting its projects around the world.